Okay, well, welcome to Mining Now, another edition of Mining Now, and we're live from Mine Expo, from the convention floor in Las Vegas. And I have the pleasure of talking with some gentlemen from Fogmaker. I've got Mario Flores. Thank you so much. Thank who you. is Segment and Area Manager. That's mining. right. Mining. Is that right? That's okay, right. Okay, good. And Johan Bierstedt. Correct. Sales and Marketing Manager with Fogmaker. Yes, yes, yes. Correct. Welcome to the show. What do you think of Mine Expo? Thank you. It's Thank a huge you. show. Huge yeah. show. It's been an amazing it's, show, it's actually. Big, yes. eh? mm. I didn't yeah. expect so many people. Um, yeah. It's huge. I mean, this hall on its own is huge, and there, there's two others out there. Yeah, so, yeah. So it's a big show. It is. I'm going to start out. I always like to start out by, by learning a little bit about you, because not all the details are on the website, right? So, so Mario, tell us a little bit about yourself. How did you get into this business? Yes, of course. Well, I've been working in sales many, many years, more than 15 years. And now I have the ability to speak Swedish, so I can go inside to this <laughs> Swedish company. So helping to expand in different markets like in Latin America and now in the business segment. So I've been working in Fogmaker more like around 10 years now. So uh, with this expertise, we development more to go inside to the mining segment. We have actually been approved of FM. So that expands us, uh, help us to open more doors into the industry. Yes. Okay. Well, great, great. Johan, what's what's your story? My story, yeah. I I'm, I'm, haven't been 10 years as Mario in Fogmaker. I've been <laughs> not only one year so far. Okay. So, yeah. I'm actually coming from one of the customers of Fogmaker. So I was introduced to the pro product yeah. Yeah, through that. And yeah. uh, it's a great company with great products. So yeah. took the chance when I... When I saw it. So you endorsing it by, by joining the company, exactly. you've endorsed it as, as a past client. Yeah, thing. yeah, yeah. That's actually true. That's oh, true. Okay. That's true. And now, as Mario describes also, when we have this, this new certificate with FM, it's really giving us good good opportunities in the mining mining business. We're already strong in, in personal uh, transportation yeah. and uh, material handling and many others. And this is really a good way to go now with, with the new certificates that we have. Okay, so that's your stories, and yes. you're sticking to them. But now, now I want to hear about Fogmaker. Tell us about about the company in general. Fogmaker was was founded back in 1995, and uh, was really uh, great uh, entrepreneurs running the business, fighting very hard to to get people to realize the risks with the vehicle fires. So it has been, a, you know, a rocky road uh, along the way, and uh, but growing all the way. So um, we have been growing 15, 20 percent uh, past years, really with a great interest from the markets. Now we are one of the big players. Okay, good. Yeah. So, so let's get into more specifics. And and what are the products? Well, what does Fogmaker? What's Fogmaker going to sell me? Yeah, well, it's it's a system indeed, like to protect the person, the machinery and all the market that is around this. So the main idea is to protect them against fires. Okay. That is really common in many machines. And also, well, Fogmaker, as you and mentioned before, is from 1995. We've been, been certified with many laboratories like RISE. We have UL certified, SPCR for heavy machineries, and also the Australian certificate. So it's one of the systems that have all these kind of achievements around the world, one of the few ones. And also, the big difference against the other system is like, for example, the powder is just break the chemical reaction that is okay. in the fire. Yeah. Okay? But so at that's the, end, the traditional yes, fire suppression exactly. system, right? So, but this is different. Yes, because at the end, the, the heat is still there, but with foam maker with our liquid inside, we produce micro droplets. These micro droplets have a more surface contact and they evaporate and absorb in the heat. This expand in a, f in a big fog okay. to take out the oxygen so the fires die automatically and we cool down at the same time, just in seconds. 
Exactly. Let's talk about our heavy industry world tour brought to you by Savannah Equipment. Find, market, and sell surplus and used equipment. And Fogmaker. Protect lives and vehicles with Fogmaker fire suppression systems because safety can never be a compromise. We are heading to events across North America and Australia and filming episodes on location. Email us at info at crownsman.com to be part of Crownsman's heavy industry world tour. Is your screen struggling to keep up with your throughput goals? General Kinematics STM screen is changing the way minds think about their screening process. The lowest cost of ownership in a vibrating screen package comes from General Kinematics. GK's technology is proven to last longer than standard mining screens. They match longevity with increased screening efficiency to create the reliable performance mine sites demand. To explore all of what General Kinematics has to offer, visit gkmining.com. In the toughest environments, you need the hardest, toughest steel. With a full range of grades designed to meet the extreme demands of hard-wearing applications, from mining to construction and heavy transport, Hardox Wear Plate has it covered. Trust Hardox Wear Steel to extend your equipment service life, boost efficiency, and power up productivity. Their wear experts partner with industry leaders to deliver solutions that stand up to any test. Ready to tackle your toughest wear challenges? Bring it on. Visit hardox.com to learn more. Petro-Canada Lubricants leads the charge with cutting-edge lubricants and greases tailored to deliver outstanding equipment protection under severe loads over extreme temperatures and environments. From surface to underground mining, their products ensure maximum uptime and savings, extending drain intervals and boosting productivity. With Petro-Canada Lubricants by your side, expect not just lubricants, but total solutions designed to keep your operation running efficiently and effectively even in the toughest conditions. Learn more at petrocanadalubricants.com. So, so, so from a layman's perspective, you know, as a mining engineer mm -hmm. that doesn't yeah. understand thermodynamics, mm -hmm. uh, not only does it put out the fire, but it cools to a point that you may not get reignition. Yeah. Yeah. Because if it stays hot, exactly. then there's still a risk. Right? Yeah. Exactly. Okay. And after that, we have a protection layer. So if okay. it's dripping diesel, oil or something like can burn again, doesn't make contact with the another area He's so it doesn't nervous. re reignite yeah so we attack all the three sides of the fire triangle okay so for real yeah so i see the products around me you can't see them on the screen but, but you can they, bring one if you they all want look pretty <laughs> shiny but uh what's your um do you sell to equipment manufacturers or do you retrofit to equipment through clients directly or what what's the model we, we work actually more with distributors, partners okay. around all the world. Yeah. Sometimes the big OEMs contact us, so okay. they want to also install the foam maker system in the machinery. Yeah. So we have that two kind of models. So very often yeah. it's via the partners, just so, making yeah. the retrofits. Yeah. Service is key when it comes to these products. So, yeah. so to, uh, to really be successful in the mining industry, we need to have service locally, and yeah. that's where it starts. Yeah, so you're not often. done when you sell it. There's uh, there, there's maintenance involved, there's training. Always. There's, there's yeah. all these yeah. support. Yeah, that's crucial yeah. to have that in place, yeah. definitely. Yeah, and you, know, and you had alluded to something a little bit earlier, and I, I'm always interested in, in innovation and adoption because it's one thing to create a new product, but then to sell it, to the market and convince them that this is better. So you've been through that process. Mm. So tell us a little bit about how you've got uh, uh, either OEMs or clients to, to adopt Fogmaker. How we do to adopt it, it's like Mario says, we are using the, the triangle of fire and that is really where, where we are basing the, the uh, argumentation that we are taking out the, the oxygen, we are taking out the heat and also the, the, the fuel. Yeah. So the, it, it is very simple. Yeah. When we compare ourselves with other systems, we can always look back and see that we have a simple system that works every time. I, I can add something more technical, yeah. like for example, the pipes that we use is really small pipes, so eight millimeters. Okay. So we can make a really tailored installation in any kind of machinery. Mm. And okay, also it's okay, more I compact see. system. Yeah. Yeah. So you create more performance. You need so much liquid like another system. So everything is more compact and efficient. Yeah. Yeah. So what, what is the actual uh, solution that's in? I don't, I don't mean the... Yeah, the agent. Yeah, yeah the agent. Water-based. 
Okay. And it's 97% water roughly, and then some salts and tensides. Okay. So it's it's pretty basic. I didn't mean that pun. No, I understand. <laughs> uh, but it's it's pretty simple stuff. Like and, you, and you're also not dealing with nasty chemicals. No, fluor free, hundred okay. percent. Yeah. Okay. Because others claim like they are fluor free, but it's like maybe some yeah. combination. But we are zero. So yes. it, it, I mean that's environmental friendly, but yes. from an operator's perspective, the the, the cleanup after something. No, it's also harmless. You clean yeah. with water, yeah. and then you're good to go again. Yeah. To, Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. So, n- also for farming, for example, when you okay. have a harvester machine, maybe oh, okay, yeah, and 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 you release the system, it will not impact the uh, the soil or the you don't don't have to clean afterwards. It, it's okay. OK Foreign Trade and Mining Company is the leading producer of injection chemicals from the mining and tunneling industries. What distinguishes OK is that all processes are managed entirely in-house, from the production of raw materials to research and development and sales. This vertical integration ensures that injection chemicals are tailored specifically to the required needs. The products are utilized for strata stabilization, roof support, and the prevention of air, gas, and water leaks. A commitment to quality is demonstrated through accreditations from NAC, IAAC, APAC, and ILAC, ensuring that all tests and products comply with the highest international standards. Visit OKDTM.com to learn more. Techway designs, manufactures, and services high-quality industrial scales and feeders. For over 50 years, processors of everything from French fries to frac sand have counted on Techway to provide the most durable, accurate, and reliable in-motion feeding, weighing, and metering equipment for their dried material handling needs. They specialize in providing tailored solutions that endure the test of time and material. Techway's quality line of products are proudly made in the USA. Learn more at techway.com. CIM is Canada's leading technical institute dedicated to the sustainability of our industry. Members enjoy professional growth opportunities through CIM libraries, publications, webinars, societies, and the job board. Experience the CIM community firsthand at the Conference of Metallurgists, August 19th to 22nd, ICARD, September 16th to 20th, and the CIM Health and Safety Conference, October 6th to 8th. Visit CIM.org for more information and join CIM today. So... There is a big movement in our industry to battery electric vehicles. And there, there's urban myths and there's mm. facts. Mm. And uh, some of us aren't sure. Know what to believe in. So. Of what to believe. But you're in this business. We are. Yeah. We are. And, and we have quite some record also in this because uh, it starts with uh, personal personal transportation mm-hmm. and, and city buses are quite often electric these days. Okay. And, yeah. and what we have seen, if you look to the facts, uh, not many fires are even reaching the batteries because batteries, what we are afraid of, of burning, of yeah. course. Yeah. The likelihood of uh, an electric bus catching fire is, is quite low, mm-hmm. but the impact, if it does, can be quite high. Yeah. So that is what we are really discussing with our customers. And uh, our recommendation is that really make a good risk assessment and understand what in the bus can create a fire. So put out those yeah. those uh, items at the source so it doesn't reach the battery. Yeah. That is the, uh, the common way to yeah. explain it. Yeah, because uh, you know, my background is underground and we begin to look at underground vehicles yeah. and we spend a lot of time trying to understand what to do if a scoop catches on fire, mm. okay? And which is a bad situation, but uh, we're implementing electric vehicles now. Correct. Yeah. We're starting to develop different methods of, mm. of dealing with them. So, so how does your product, is it a different product for different vehicles or is it the... It's the same. It's the same, same actually, same because product. the water mist is not conducted. So okay. it, it works very good. So the, the traditional method would be different, wouldn't it? I don't under, I'm not sure. Yeah. Well, like a, a, if, a typical if, foam suppression system? Well, it's different, yeah, because this yeah. is the micro droplets, yeah. not like a foam. Yeah. So we absorb the heat. So, so at the end, it evaporates yeah. and take out the oxygen. So it's, it's different. Mm. The foam is like a insulation, but the heat is still there because the droplets is huge. It's, it's it. more like water. Yeah. So it takes more time to evaporate. Yeah. In our case, it's because it's micro droplets, they evaporate immediately. Yeah. So at the end, it's... And there's nothing just left to react. Uh, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Good. So, so what's what's the future of Fogmaker? And, and, and I'll ask this in two parts. One, in terms of uh, uh, geographic 
expansion, uh, yeah. expansion uh, well, and I, two in terms of technical. So let's start with your markets. Yes, actually, we started on a new subsidiary in Brazil. Okay. Working now there because Brazil is kind of hard market. And now we're working hard to okay, go to and break into it. Breaking yeah. it. Good. Yes. And we have another subsidiary in Finland, right? Yes, correct. Okay. And coming Finland. soon is yeah. Thailand as well. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. So we historically, we, of course, we are we are the whole market is Scandinavia, yeah. Europe. So we're scaling up uh, according to that. Yeah. And uh, to make local business, you need to be local. That's that's what we think. Yeah, I so think that that stems from what you'd mentioned earlier about the service. Mm. So it's it's not just enough to sell the product. No, yeah. exactly. If that, someone doesn't understand it. Or needs some work. Yeah, we need You've to, got to be there to support. Yeah. It's like our partner said, yeah. service is a product. Yeah, it yeah. is. It is. It is. Okay, so so that's that's uh, when we talk about markets. Uh, in terms of technology, what what what's happening? Are you looking at different things? We, we are building on on what we have. If we want to, you know, be very very basic, we can say that we have one product, and we yeah. are using that for for different segments. So yeah. it's more the go-to-market strategy okay. that is different between the yeah. segments. That is the challenge for us. In and terms of, course, of market, you're not just geographic, but also how industry. You do. Yeah, industry. exactly. Yeah. Because yeah. the demands are different in different uh, yeah. segments. You could take uh, forestry from from mining, from material handling. It can be different strategies. Yeah. So we are trying to to capture that and be strong in in the segments where we have demands. And of course, we need different approach. Because perhaps the system that is for material handling doesn't adapt for mining. Yeah. So we need, we are always developing and making system for every kind of segment. Yeah. Mm. Well, this has been uh, one reason I like doing mining now is, I, mm. is, uh, is I'm always learning. Oh, yeah. yeah. And I knew a little bit about fire suppression mm. from historic mm. operation of scoops and trucks underground. But, but this, this is really interesting. This is a different approach mm. that's better. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we have a good, reliable product, yeah. you know, and we and, and it stands for itself. Also, we just need to take it to the market, yeah. And, and yeah, excellent. And so I'm glad you're at Mining Expo to <laughs> Mine Expo to tell people about it. Uh, anything that you'd like to leave our audience with? Well, I'll start with you. Start with me. Yeah, I think uh, the PFAS that is quite important to us, and, and we have developed now all our certificates also more or less with the PFAS free uh, agent and uh, that is from the beginning you know from from legal perspectives and uh, we thought it should be yeah. demands from from authorities but we can see also over time that it's really a customer demand it's not it's driven international only international yeah. recognition exactly big yeah. customers that want to stay green and they they want to have best choices when it comes also to to these products yeah. so it's customer driven okay very good Mario? yeah so i will say like the company is always developing the product, the system. So at the end, I think we'll get a better product anytime. Mm. So the people will know more about Foodmaker. So with the time, I think at the end, we will be more segmented uh, approaching. So every customer now is Foodmaker, but with different, with different focus. But this, the, at, the, at the end, the, same, the, heart, the, the heart of Foodmaker is the same too prevent any fires and it's safety, save lives safety protect our yeah. people exactly. it's, uh, it's great to hear that's what exactly. we do okay well johan mario mm -hmm. thank you very much i really enjoyed this discussion thank you and so much. thank you our audience this is mining now and we're, we've been talking with johan and mario from fog maker and we're at mine expo in vegas thank you for joining us